This is actually kind of a tough equation to balance, so I'll show you how I do it. We have sulfuric acid plus aluminum hydroxide gives us aluminum sulfate plus H2O water. So I've written down all the atoms in the equation, and we're going to count them up on each side. I have two hydrogens, and then I have this SO4 here and over here. So I'm just going to count the SO4s as, as one item. So I have one SO4 here, and then oxygens won't count these. I'm going to count just the oxygens that appear outside of the SO4. So three times one, three of those, one aluminum. Over here, I have two hydrogens. Then I have three SO4s, three sulfates, one oxygen, and two aluminum. Let's start by balancing the aluminums, because I have one here and two here. So I can just put a two in front of the AlOH3, and that means that I'll have one times two, two aluminum atoms, and then three times a one, three oxygens, times the two. So three times two, that'll give me six oxygen atoms. And then for the hydrogens, we'll need to add these two, plus we have the three times a one, three times two is six. So we'll have eight hydrogen atoms. All right why don't we do the sulfates next? Because we have one sulfate here and three here. We can put a three right here. And let's see what that does. We have one sulfate times the three. That fixes the sulfates. And we need to update the hydrogens now. So let's do that. So I have two times three, that's six hydrogens, plus the three times the two, six. That gives me 12 hydrogen atoms. All right, we're getting closer. Let's fix these hydrogens here. So we need 12, we have two. We'll put a six right here, two times six. That equals 12. And then for our oxygens, we now have the one times the six. That gives us six oxygen atoms. And everything's the same. We've balanced the equation. You can split up the SO4 and count the individual atoms. That's okay and that works. You do sometimes run into problems because you're not sure how to add coefficients in front of these compounds to get the right number of oxygens. So putting it as a sulfate, counting as this SO4, that can save you a lot of trouble. This is Dr. B with the balanced equation for H2SO4 plus ALOH3 yields Al2SO4 3 plus H2O. Thanks for watching.